the International Dance Festival Birmingham is a fascinating, very important thing because a lot of the period we have festivals around UK which is predominantly showcasing British artists but it's this whole thing that I was talking about exchange and collaboration which is so important in today's time I feel um, and this, this festival just allows that to happen where people uh, artists who are trained here, people, audience get to see work from all over the world and I think it's great that it's not just happening in London I have to say and I was so happy that David Massingham and the team took us on board because we need more festivals like this. I think it's absolutely crucial for the, for the artist, for the public to grow and learn from other cultures. Um, and I think art has a way of transcending kind of, um, let's say, Big Brother, you know? Uh, it has a more spiritual way, it has a more kind of philosophical way, it has a conceptual way, it has a physical way, it has so many other elements. Birmingham was one of the first places where I presented, um, where I did a workshop with a friend of mine called Maven Koo, and it was, I think it was, it was in this building where um, we explored a piece called No Mel Egos, which eventually became a full-length piece, um, and I have great memories of it because um, I used to kind of um, take the train or coach over from Leicester when I was st studying at De Montfort, and I would just be envious at, um, uh, particularly Nahid Siddiqui, who is a wonderful Catholic dancer who used to perform here, but not so much in Leicester. So I was envious that she was in this city and I remember coming over on weekends and then eventually I got offered to do this thing with um, uh, this like duet with research with, uh, with um, Maven Koo. And um, so I have fond memories of Birmingham. And there's a huge, of course, as we all know, Indian audience, Asian audience, but what's interesting is um, it's a very well-informed audience because artists like Nahiji has been here and so the audience have high standards um, and there are some wonderful uh, young dancers as well, um, you know, like Sonia Sabri who's absolutely stunning and, uh, you know, it, 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 when, you, when you perform in Birmingham, What's wonderful with the festival is that they get to know, you get, you've get you developed a, a, a contemporary audience, but it also has a classical audience. And so whenever you perform in Birmingham, you always feel like, okay, these people know what they're, they're about to see, so you better work hard. 